Megan, you talk about loan modifications. Get on the phone. And, yeah, yeah, this is such an important thing because we really need, this is one place that we really do need some guidance from government or, or, or at least from business and getting some structure. There is no regulation right now to loan modifications. There are companies out there doing loan modifications that aren't really helping necessarily. Some are, many aren't. You want to be very careful. Again, you want to go to your lender directly. You want to talk to them first, and you want to explain the situation. See what what, they what do you mean they're it. not helping? They're putting them into new mortgages that are worse than the ones they were in? Is that the problem? Or? They're, they're, they're not putting them in new mortgages. When they're modifying the loan, they're either uh, negotiating with the lender terms, I mean, for different are, terms. Right, right. but that are, that are more onerous or did, that are just not as good at terms? Well, how are they hurting people? They may not be as good as what they can get directly on the lender themselves, right. and they're paying a fee to get that that may be absorbent in some cases. Okay, good enough. That was, yep. And, well, I was going to say that what we're waiting for from the government and from the lenders are reworks and modifications yep. that do work for people because you've seen the redefault rate, the numbers coming out where it's more than half of people whose loans were reworked are back in default what, six well, months later. Yeah. Yep. But again, we're talking about probably people, the but lenders forgiving part of the balance. That's really maybe the solution rather than just lowering the rate because lowering the rate for a lot of people isn't going to keep them current on the right. house. It's just not enough. Interesting. Yeah, I, 